Hi, my name is Audrey Thomas, founder of Organized Audrey, and today's productivity pointer is actually four tips that will help you be productive throughout your day. I'm standing in my kitchen because this is where it all starts for me every morning. Several years ago, my doctor challenged me on how much water I was taking in each day, and I confessed to him that I have a really hard time drinking my eight glasses of water every day. So he said, Audrey, as soon as you get up in the morning, do your normal routine of going to the bathroom and whatnot. But he said, go to your kitchen sink and see how much water you can drink down because that's when your body is the most thirstiest. And you know what? He was right. I can now drink almost this entire bottle, which is 24 ounces, first thing in the morning. And it just really jump starts my day when it comes to my water intake. The second challenge that he gave to me is the second tip that I want to give to you, and that is make sure you're eating plenty of protein first thing in the morning because protein is food for the brain, and that's what's going to help you focus when you get to the office. Uh, my doctor suggested that I take in between 20 and 25 grams of protein. So that might be two eggs and a couple slices of bacon. Um, I might have a glass of milk or a side of cottage cheese. Um, your protein is going to be found in... Uh, meats and dairy and legumes and some other sources like that. So if you're not a traditional breakfast food person, that's okay. Maybe you have a leftover chicken breast from the night before because that's loaded with protein as well. The third tip that I'm going to give to you that helps you be productive throughout your day is move. Studies and research have shown that when we get up and move every 45 to 60 minutes throughout our day, we are going to be more productive throughout the entire day. So even if you're in the middle um, of a really big project, take a, take a moment, once an hour, and get up and stretch, walk around the office. If you can, um, go outside and get some fresh air and, and walk a little bit there and come back because you're going to end up being more productive um, in, in the long run when, you, when you're doing different types of movements throughout your day. And then the fourth tip that I want to give to you is to use a planner like this. This is a worksheet called the First 15 that I created recently and we are getting amazing feedback from companies and departments and organizations that are using it. And it's a free download for you. Just follow the link below. But basically what this is, is this is a worksheet that you will fill out the first 15 minutes of your day when you get to the office. And it really outlines your priorities for the day, the different people that you need to connect with for the day. It even has a spot that you can jot down some random thoughts and ideas that come to you while you're in the middle of a project that you don't want to stop working on. So you can just quickly record it and go right back to work. This is really a plan for you so that you can have a more productive day at the office. I hope you have enjoyed this productivity pointer brought to you by Organized Audrey, where our goal is to help you get more done with less stress. Make it a great day.